Okay, so, no, I thought it was that way, but I'm wrong. It's this way. Yeah. So we're gonna go up, try and get to the top of the falls. All right, so we're gonna go take the spur to the top of the falls, and then I guess on the way back we'll come this way for a different part of the loop and head on over to the sheep cave on our way out. Pretty narrow. <laughs> yeah. Down there at the base of the falls, it was so, so slippery. And then I found those giant sinkholes where the water goes into the underground river. Oh, that was scary. Oh, here it is. Top of the falls. So I went through the underground part of the falls, now on top of the falls. See? We <laughs> can go back that way. This is the cable that comes out of the top. Go ahead, Gigi. Thank you. That's cold. That is cold. That's like hot and then like refrigerator cold. <laughs> Come, man. Yeah. Come feel this. So that's the cave where all the water comes out of. Up here. Goes down this little stream here and it falls off the other end of it. Come. Look. See how cold it is here? I mean, here it's like literally cold. And right back there, it's like 90 degrees, and here it's gotta be what, 50? <laughs> it's cold. All right. Let's see if I can stay out of trouble here. Try not to. Oh, cold, yeah. 
You gonna be cold? Or me? I'm gonna try and go right to the city entrance, basically. If I can get down there safely, which I think I can. I'll be very cautious. As a tube or water comes through, that tube up there is dry right now. Big cave in up here. All right, my shoe's sliding out. The water's very cold. But I'm not gonna go any further with that cave in. All right, so by now you probably saw us hike to see Virgin Falls. You, depending on how we end up in this video, you might see me walk down to the base of the falls, even behind the falls. We now ventured up to the top of the falls and have some video of me going slightly into this cave here. This is the cave at the top of the falls where the water begins and it flows downstream out of this cave under this little land bridge here and across this little short section of basically I guess would be a river. Um, and then it falls off into Great Virgin Falls. So, with our episode this time, you've been able to see the entirety of Virgin Falls, all the way from the source water, way up in there, to the falls itself, and then beneath the falls and the giant sinkholes that the falls flow into. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I think I'm gonna come in and take a picture. Find a picture out there. So these are not slippery, right? No. That one moves a lot. I use this. That back there is the land bridge we're standing on top of, and behind that's that big cave where the water is originating from. And the little black slice on the bottom of that, where the water is dead ending, that's actually the water kind of going underneath, not kind of. That's the water going underneath that land bridge, coming down this stream here, and tumbling off the edge here. And that right there is the 
fall to Virgin Falls. I only get too close to the edge, it is very slippery. And as a hundred foot drop, we won't survive if we go off the edge. Yeah. Okay, everybody, uh, thank you for watching, and uh, we made it back. Um, anyway, so it was a great hike. It took a long time. We added those extra little spurs. So again, the hike out to Virgin Falls, if you really went just there and back, it's um, seven miles. No, four and a half, nine miles, sorry. Four and a half each way, so it's nine miles total. However, I just saw in our series of videos that we went out to uh, some other spur trails in the area, so we went to the top of the falls, back behind the cave in the falls, also out to uh, Sheep Cave um, and around those areas as well. So according to phone, just about 12.3 uh, miles. So it was a long day. It took us uh, just over seven hours in total here. Um, but it was definitely well worth it. It was a lot of fun. Izzy's here with me. She's just holding the phone right now because um, unfortunately my GoPro ran out of battery power um, and I don't have a long enough arm with my phone to do really justice. So anyhow, so that's what's up. Say hi, baby. She's with us here. Uh, but anyway, we're tired, we had a great day. And uh, in case you haven't seen us hint before at it, ta -da! So this is our newest, latest, and greatest version of Just In Time. We have Just In Time 2.0, which is our YouTube channel. We also have Just In Time Adventures, which is our guided hiking tour company that we operate throughout the state of Tennessee. And uh, our other channel, which is Echo Force One, Hiking With A Purpose about responsible hiking and you know taking out what you take in and leaving nothing behind but footprints and taking on pictures that kind of stuff. So anyhow, uh, thank you for watching. Salama Put. Thank you. <laughs>